You're watching the one and only ABC 3340, the station working for you. These days, it's more and more difficult to recruit individuals into law enforcement. That's a challenge all the time, but recruiting women is even much harder. It's an issue that those serving and protecting are trying to highlight during the inaugural Women in Law Enforcement Conference. ABC 3340's Olivia Goche spoke with women who serve about the challenges they face in addressing inequalities in the profession. Advocating for equity, diversity, and inclusion to empower future leaders in the community. Today's theme of the inaugural Women in Law Enforcement Conference. Jefferson County Deputy Chief Nashonda Howard says this event gives her the opportunity to give back. We also face challenges as women in law enforcement. We want to be recognized. We want people to understand that we put the badge on every day. We put the gun belt on every day. And we work just as hard as our male counterparts. And we do this because we have a passion to serve. Currently, women make up only 12% of sworn officers and 3% of police leadership in the U.S. Women from across the state in Alabama and Georgia discussed understanding the glass ceiling and challenges faced by women in law enforcement. There are a lot of females across the board um, that don't, don't believe that law enforcement is, they have a place in law enforcement. Um, being a female, I can tell them that we all have a place here and we are definitely needed. When I first started in law enforcement, I was told it was a man's world and women have the right to be in law enforcement. We're needed. Events like this is what inspire us to do better, to go further. Um, it gives us that, that strength to where we can feel like we can accomplish anything. Speakers and women in attendance pointed out how many skills possessed by women are beneficial in the field of law enforcement. Um, the mothering instinct in us is really very useful. We can de-escalate situations um, and not have to use force. Research suggests that women are less likely to use force and more likely to be better perceived by communities as more honest and compassionate. Olivia Goche, ABC 3340 News. Attendees of the event say they hope today's event will lead to meaningful conversations about how to bring more women into law enforcement.